Giddy up. That's a big pig. Let's go. Better stay hidden.
Did you get lost? Here. I killed your piggy for you. Hmm. You are skilled. Of that there is no doubt. I have plenty of talents. Of that you can be sure. Oh, is that so? Well, I look forward to putting them all to the test. Oh? And what did you have in mind? <laughs> Many things. But first, to business. There are beasts that roam this world, but are not fully of it. They've been placed here by the gods as trials, as tests. These beasts are creatures like any other. The world is full of mysteries, but not everything unexplained is ordained by the gods. Perhaps before this is over, you will have a different opinion. What exactly do you want me to do? I want you to prove your worth in the eyes of Artemis and hunt these creatures. I don't need to prove my worth to anyone. Just tell me what's the reward. With each pelt you return, I will grant you a boon from Artemis. If you are able to slay all the beasts, well, let's say your relationship with the daughters of Artemis will be forever changed. All right, I'll do it. Now, just how many of these animals are there? Artemis has laid out eight trials, and you have already started the journey. Hunt down those that remain. How will I recognize the creatures? Oh, you'll know. Bring the pelts to me. I'll await your return with my sisters, the daughters of Artemis. I hope you don't make me wait too long to see your face again. Treacherous around chaos. We should be careful. <laughs> what? Charybdis and Scylla await at the bottom of the sea, I suppose. No! Pirates! A lot of them! <laughs> Only pirates? When you're ready, meet me at the Pnyx in Athens.
Pasito. Here. I might have a job for you. If you're as good a fighter as I've heard. You've heard of me? Don't let it go to your head. I hear about everything that happens in this city, Mistyos. With flattery like that, how could I possibly turn you down? I'm not trying to flatter you. I'm trying to hire you. I need some Spartan military targets removed. I think you may have the wrong idea about me, General... Demos Thenis. I'm not a murderer, if that's what you expected. I expected you were someone who wants to get paid. Was I wrong? No. Not completely. Fine. What do you want? My spies tell me the Spartans are mobilizing. What I want you to do is hamstring them. Get into their forts and remove the commanders in charge. I guess that makes sense. I'm thrilled you approve. You'll need to bring me the sailors of the commanders you kill as proof. You'll be amply rewarded. Those don't seem like standard Athenian tactics. They're not. But it will work, and that's what matters. We've already lost too many Athenians to those savages using traditional warfare. The other generals disagree, but I refuse to let them destroy our chances. What do they want to do? They want honorable face-to-face -face warfare, pitting our forces directly against the Spartans. We're not going to win a contest of strength against those brutes. We need to outthink them. So, will you kill the commanders? All right, I'll take the job. Good. I might not have approval to deploy our men to do this, but I'm not about to let that stop me. Where can I find them? The Spartans have been making inroads into Athenian territory, taking over forts that once belonged to us. Make them pay for every inch. What's your strategy? Whatever it takes to protect Athenian lives and kill Spartans. That's not what I meant. What's your personal strategy? My career is none of your business. Know that I don't seek much. Only proper recognition of my strategic brilliance. What's so special about these seals? Only elite Spartan commanders carry these seals. Those in charge of entire forts. They'd all die before parting with them. So bring me the seals as proof that they're dead. You've told me enough. I'll get your seals for you, General. may draw near to our walls, but we must come together now for the glory of Athens! Glory for you! <laughs> Friend, friends, please! Just because the Spartans are near our walls does not mean we can act like them! A good crop! Shame the Spartans! Burn the fields where it grew! The Parthenon is glorious, Pericles, but at what cost? How many tree dams could we have built instead? We must not become divided! We are divided! And the Spartans are winning! Act, Pericles, or I will! Oh, good. You 
came. Things are worse than I feared. Cleon has turned the mob. We have to hurry. Where? To Pericles. Stay back! She is no threat to Pericles, I assure you. Ah, Herodotus. It's fine. Let them through. It's good to see you again, Pericles. And you as well. I only wish it were under better circumstances. And who's this? Cassandra. Welcome, Cassandra. And what did you think of your first taste of Athens? I think you and Cleon both made good points. Good points aren't at all what the crowd seem to care about. They're afraid, and Cleon indulged their fear. Pericles, we've come to... We must choose our moment wisely, and speak our words more privately. Fine. We've come to you on urgent business. As does everybody. I may have told Cassandra you'd invite her to your symposium. You'd ask me to exclude every Athenian and invite an outsider instead. You heard the crowd. They don't need another reason to hate me. If she's working for you, maybe the prying eyes will see her as a servant. I'm no one's servant. Cassandra, this is Athens. If you want something, sometimes you have to play a role. And what exactly is it that you want? I'm looking for a woman who's very important to me. Herodotus said a symposium could be useful for gaining information. He would be correct. I can get you in, although I can't promise the information you seek will be found. Just tell me what to do. First, check on my colleague, Mediochos. He was meant to meet me today, and it's not like him to miss an appointment. Done. My friend, Phidias, needs to be taken out of Athens as soon as possible. Anything else? Yes. There is an ostracism vote taking place that could use your... Uh, influence. Meteochos. You said he was your colleague? A politician and ally. He's one of my most loyal friends. Phidias? The famous sculptor? What did he do, exactly? He stands accused of multiple offenses and is awaiting trial. You'll find him under close guard at his workshop. I'll do it. I'll expect you to use discretion. That went well. It isn't exactly an invitation, but the promise of one is just as good. Although I'm sure he'll still ask Aspasia if it's okay. So long as it comes. Share a friend. I saw you talking to my associate, Pericles. From what I saw, you weren't doing much associating. That's just politics. Pericles is a good man, a fine man, just not the right man. That's not what I heard. From whose lips? His? He was elected. Athens is the seat of democracy. Oh, it is. It's just that the wrong man is sitting in that seat. Did you actually need something, or did you just want to educate me on the finer points of democracy? Pericles is holding parties for the rich and powerful while we're under siege. What I want is for my people to reclaim control. You could help me. My services don't come cheap. I understand the wills of commerce and the needs of the people. I will pay you handsomely for your services. And how do you want me to help? Help Athens, not me. The Spartans howl outside our city walls. Create chaos among their ranks. Make them suffer as we do. 
Think about it. Will you take my commission and show the Spartans we are not defeated yet? I have no problem killing Spartans. Good. Kill their commander, Nabis. Destroy their supplies and return to me with proof of your exploits. Show them that we have teeth, too. I'll get it done. Trust me, this is a huge opportunity for you. I'm glad we stopped by. You must be the one Pericles sent. I am. He said there was an ostracism vote, but didn't tell me what I'm here to do. Of course he didn't. But that's what I'm for. If someone is exiled, can they return? If they do, they'll be punished. What does someone have to do to be ostracized? Anyone seen as a threat to the city or the people is enough. And then it is up to the vote. Some have been ostracized for simply being more disliked than the person they're up against. What's my role in this? The votes have already been cast. We don't have long before they're counted. Take the Ostraka in this bag and exchange them with the ones currently under guard. You want me to rig the ostracism? Pericles does. And he has his reasons, I'm sure. Bring me the bag you took from the room and I'll take care of the rest. No one will see me go in or out. Stay here.
I don't want to be seen. Should do it. I should let Pericles' contact know.
what that was. from all over the Greek world. You wouldn't think the city was besieged by an army of Spartans. It's done. Hmm. You work quickly. What are you going to do with them? Dump them in a well. Ah, it looks like the official has arrived. I apologize for the delay. There was evidence someone attempted to tamper with the votes. Don't worry. The Ostraka are all accounted for. The votes were counted, and Anaxagoras is to be ostracized! Be slow to fall into friendship, but once you do, continue firm and constant. It will be more difficult for me now that Anaxagoras must leave Athens. We were quite close, although he and Pericles were much closer. It's strange, Pericles wasn't here today to defend him. Would Pericles normally defend someone? A good friend? Of course. Yet, Anaxagoras seems pleased with the result. This day has brought more questions than answers. You said you were close. He was like a mentor to me. Many of my best thoughts came to fruition through our conversations. Who are you? Ask anyone and they'll tell you Socrates. But a name gives you nothing. Our actions determine who we are, and every action has its pleasures and its price. With that said, then, 
Who do you claim to be? My name is Cassandra. And still, I don't feel I know you. Perhaps I can find out who you are a different way. You want to know me? Knowledge is the one good in this world. Surely you agree? Of course. Knowledge drives everything I do. Then we are the same in that way. Knowledge of when to attack, what weapon to use, or when to use reason instead of violence. We seem to put our love of knowledge into practice quite differently. I use it how I need to. You are clearly someone who would do whatever you feel is necessary. Perhaps for Drahmi, or maybe to further a personal goal. That describes a lot of people. I suppose I'm curious why you did it. How could I not be when you're the reason my friend is being forced to leave the only home he's ever known? I did what I was asked to do. And your needs are greater than those of the man you helped ostracize. Still, you raise a fine point. Who is more responsible? Anaxagoras for getting himself mixed up in this? Or you, for simply sealing his fate? I'm not responsible for his actions. I have one thing to think about, my own. Then I hope you also think about today, about Anaxagoras, about choice. Socrates, there you are. Here I am. You're late. They're all waiting for you. I wish to see Anaxagoras's fate, and so I have. Tell them I'm on my way. Well, it seemed our conversation is at its end. Although I hope it isn't the final one we have. I wouldn't know. That will bring more hunters after me. Stop. I can't let you go any further. Stand aside. This is important. So is keeping people out. Maybe you can see Phidias after his trial, if the people spare his life. Listen, I'm working for Pericles. He wants me to see Phidias. Well, I'm working for the people of Athens, and they want Phidias dead. Now back off, or you're dead too. Everyone has a price. How much drachmi is this going to take? Depends how much you have. Here, take it. That'll do just fine. You tell anyone I did this and you're as good as dead. Funny. I was going to say the same to you.
Sorry about that. How did you get past the guard? No one gets past the guard. Relax. Ricles sent me. Ah, praise Athena. I knew he'd send help. I was worried they sent someone after me. He sent me to get you out of Athens. So he knows about the plot. You mean the trial? From what I've seen, you don't stand a chance. Ah, the people love me. I am the Fidias. But there are others. Look. Malaka. It isn't the trial Pericles is saving you from. These are instructions to murder you. Who wrote this? I don't know who to trust. I'm just an artist. I just wanted to create. Please, what am I to do? First, you need to pull yourself together. You're on trial, the people are against you, and now I find that the cult want to kill you. Uh, I said, pull yourself together! Yes, of course. Cleon said, you're wasting the people's drachmi. If he had his way, he'd serve them your head. Cleon mentioned me? That's going to hurt Pericles. First impiety, now theft. After all we've done for this city. You and Pericles seem close. For Pericles and me, it started with our love of Athens. Our differences push us to greatness. That is true friendship. All right, we need to go. Do you have any idea where I can take you? South of Athens, there's an island called Seriphos. My friend Theras lives there. When I discovered the plot against me, I sent word to him. If anyone can help us, he can. Any clues he has of the cultist's identities, I want them. Yes, yes, anything. A guard! I'll distract them while you sneak out. Meet me tonight to set sail for Seriphos. Don't show your face until you see me at the docks. I understand. You didn't really think I'd let you come and go as you please, did you? Now, where are you?
If I meditate, maybe Phidias will be here when I'm done. Good. You made it. I was beginning to worry. I told you I'd get you out of Athens. So you did. Can your friend be trusted? Theras and I have been friends for a long time. I just sent word telling him where to meet us. Wasting time will only get us into trouble. Let's head to Seriphos while we still can. Be danger ahead, Commander. Hey, looks like something valuable. I never thought. Ah. I've left places I've called home. Hopefully, the cult won't bother me now. turning as much as mine is. You'll get used to it. We'll reach Seriphus before long. It's good to see you alive and well, Phidias. And you, Theras. As you can see, I didn't get here alone. Ah, yes. The kind and thoughtful hero you mentioned in your letter. I'm glad I could get him out alive. And for that heroism, I found some information on a man named Brisson who's plotting Phidias' early demise. Hopefully you can make something of this clue. I can. Please give Pericles my thanks and my farewell. And be careful. I still believe many in Athens are in danger. <laughs> 